Well, I hope next year we are waiting under different situations. Well then, e-commerce now. Let's talk to Andrea Scarano, country manager, Italy for VP. Here he is. Buongiorno. Ciao, David. Ciao. Good morning. Thank you, David, for uh, having me. Welcome back. So you were also in the right place at the right time, correct? Tell us more about VP. Um, you changed your name, well, not recently, but maybe somebody still knows you with your uh, old name, and then you also um, did some acquisitions. Yes, we are the digital European digital partner chosen by uh, fashion and lifestyle brands for their promotions. We have a B2B store um, and we are brands first because we uh, develop services um, and products for the brands. So um, this is the uh, idea we are based on and our mission hasn't changed throughout the years. We want to take care uh, of the stock of big brands. We want to um, attach more value to the stocks, um, protecting uh, brand value. Our adventures started um, in in the middle of the nineties, um, pardon, nineteen eighties. Um, our founder created a company to manage the stock of big fashion brands. At the end of the nineteen uh, nineties, there were the stock list. Yes. So they, uh, he had the intuition uh, to move the brand uh, online. Uh, online was started just um, um, to become uh, known. In 2001, uh, he founded vanprivé.com and he created the word of flash sales. We uh, launch uh, tens of flash sales every year and they share every day, pardon, and they um, share some um, features such as uh, being from big brands. Then there is a determined stock uh, with incredible deals. So you launch a uh, flash sales, analyzing what's the stock of the company, what's uh, in stock, and uh, then matching a price. Yes, and then it is then it is a flash sale. So they end within three to five days. And they can only be accessed by our customer base. How many consumers do you have in Italy? In the world, we have 72 million uh, profiled users. In Italy, it's 12 million. So th um, we're talking about people who receive your emails. Yes correct, uh, it became an instant success because it is an unprogrammed purchase. The impulse buy prompted by the wish to discover new brands, new product, what's on um, sale that day. The sellout curve are in really significant, especially in the first hours. Um, it became an instant success and Van Privé became one of the uh, digital unicorns in Europe. 2007, uh, we began our European expansion in Italy and Spain and other countries. And in 2016, we um, had an organic growth and we completed um, a, um, acquisition of other players. And in 2018, under the uh, VP umbrella, we uh, merged Van Privé uh, and um, other brands, and we had uh, rebranding in 2019. And you are listed on the market. No, we aren't. What's your turnover? 3.8 billion euros. We are in 12 countries with more 
uh, with more than uh, 7,000 brands and uh, 72 million um, users, subscribe users. Our core business is fashion, then we added kids, sport, home, um, food and wine, travels as well. Yeah, as well, not uh, nowadays, but lifestyle, but our core is fashion. How did the attitude of consumers and brands change in the past few months? Um, everyone gravitated online. We are close to brands. So many of the brands uh, started their digitalization and this accelerated um, notably as the partners. We tried and helped them to make it um, more swift. So um, we help our quality um, customers. We have um, many mobile shoppers and uh, four or five million of mobile shoppers arrive on our um, online windows to shop. So it has been an incredible year, a unique year for us of course, with many ups and downs. In, during the first lockdown, as we mentioned, uh, we were uh, concerned by um, safety and basic needs. And then fashion started expanding. In Italy, we see many resources for, fashion, for the fashion market, which is, has an incredible dimension. We've seen it uh, also in terms of e-commerce. Um, we see a growth in fashion e-commerce in Italy. We will continue growing beyond the pandemic. Uh, our growth has been double digit digits for um, a few years now. And Italy is doing well in the internal market and in terms of export as well. We're talking about big brands and we have the chance to export these um, excellent products um, to Europe. Italy has an added value, so it plays a strategic role for us. Do you help brands with stocks? Maybe uh, some brands had more stock than usual. Would you, were you able to help them or was the other way around so you didn't have enough uh, items available? There is uh, no specific trend uh, in one sense or the other. Our vision has always been uh, long term, so beyond pandemic. Um, when we sit at a table with a brand, we don't plan a campaign. We want to help them develop um, strategic partnership for the long term. Our founder has been a partner uh, for of top brands for 35 years, so um, every situation is different. Sometimes we help brands selling their stock. S for other brands, uh, some the stock was missing, but we know that we're in it for the long term. Do you work with luxury I, um, brands or only fashion brands? Luxury brands um, were uh, always our partners. Some um, are starting to approach uh, VP. Uh, some will arrive in the future. They, of course, uh, need um, have different needs because their um, customers want a different communication. So uh, the collocation of uh, luxury brands in our, um, on our website needs to be different. Uh, communication strategies are different. So we are focusing on that for our future development. So your almost four billions um, are done via flash sales. The majority, of course, uh, are you looking to expand your um, window shop as um, Amazon does? 
in a more traditional way. I wouldn't talk uh, about tradition because we have a B2B DNA. Uh, we start everything from our l relationship with the brand. So we are developing that. We uh, call this brand's place because uh, we don't want it to be a marketplace. At the core of our project, we have brands. We don't have the market. So this space is managed by the brand. The brand called the shots. So we have a stock that's uh, more recent with different uh, promotional policies, different pricings to give a wider range of products to extend the life cycle of the product we uh, deal with and to uh, help brands interact with a very large customer base. So can I go to your website? And yes, you can uh, look at flash sales and uh, then another section where there, uh, there is a um, continuous offer and this will uh, become stronger in the future. In Italy, uh, this accounts for 10% of our business in Italy. So we're not starting from scratches here in, in Italy. So your guidelines for the futures, for the future? Well, these projects. So we want to um, go hand in hand with brands. I think there's a lot of work to do. Um, our goal for 2021 is to extend our offer in a way or another. So we want to add new brands, new products to our offer and to help uh, more brands managing their stock. 